Welcome to the family! Hey everybody, you have McGann, and if you haven't seen Reboot, it is one of the best animated series I've ever seen. You have to give it a little while to get into it, but towards the end of season two and season three are just mwah, brilliant. Plus the movies are brilliant too. I absolutely adore this series, so I wanted to show off my definitive mainframe edition of the complete Reboot show. And this was done by Mainframe, which is a Canadian company, but I think now they go by Rainmaker Studios, something like that. Sorry if I'm a little off there. And this set is a little bit strange because it's kind of backwards and you can see up here it's a nine DVD set so it's humongous nothing on the bottom we've got the backside all 47 episodes on nine DVDs and I will say keep in mind I do believe they count the two movies Damon Rising and My Two Bobs as individual episodes because they were like half of a season and they never finished the other half of season four I know it hurt me too but I don't think it has reboot the ride which was the IMAX movie and I I think there could have been a second IMAX movie I think I've heard rumored about, but I, like I said, I don't know anything about that, so I can't help you there. But I will pull out these beautiful, yeah, you get a set just to pull out more tinier box sets. So these are DVDs. I don't believe Reboot has ever come out on Blu-ray, at least not yet. I would love to find it on digital. I would totally buy it again on digital. This is just the bonus features with mouse and the healed hexadecimal or the sprite hexadecimal. I don't remember officially what they called her. And I'm sure the art of this series will look a little dated, but the story is great and the characters are wonderful. Okay, traffic window, bonus features, fast forward the making of Reboot, looking back at Reboot with co-creator Gavin Blair and animated character models. So there are no shorts or tests that it looks like on here, just a little bit of different documentaries on Reboot. And then there's a picture of Mainframe if you take out the disc. And we have Mouse, our great warrior, on the cover here of this disc. Reboot season one and two. Top, side, bottom, back warning incoming game and that's the great thing about this show it's about the people inside of your computer that play the games as the NPCs so I just thought that this was brilliant from day one here are season one and two you can see it's not like some of the series where you get two or three episodes on a disc we've got what looks like five to six on each disc and we get the original air dates over here on the corner I don't know that I noticed that before along with the synopsis of each episode and I can tell you right here in disc four where it says Andrea, that's where the series starts getting pretty good. But these are the two seasons that aired on ABC, so it was kind of held back a little bit creatively to be an all-audience kind of show. But once it got canceled, oh yes, I should finish showing you. Here's the front of these covers. We have Enzo, Bob, Megabyte, and Hexadecimal. You will recognize that is the same Megabyte from the new series, Reboot the Guardian Code. But believe me, he's much better in this format. And then inside it's the same picture of mainframe on the back so I won't pull all these discs out but we have ready to go Bob and a really business looking dot. I don't think she wears that look though until the later seasons. Then we have Enzo and Frisket and Megabyte. The voice, the voice, I think it's J something or something J. Oh gosh, I wish I could remember off the top of my head. But the voice of Megabyte, the original voice, is so incredible. He is a voice that the whole world of the voice acting community misses terribly. Now we'll go on to season three and four's packaging. And here's where Enzo starts going and becoming a mini guardian for the computer. Nine and a half hours. Oh. Okay, we have Glitch Bob, which is where Bob and Glitch became one, the Battle Room Dot, Andrea, and Matrix as their adult forms. So yeah, there's a lot of fun twists and turns in this series. And this is more episode lists. Looks like we've got an average of six on each disc with the air dates and everything. And if you notice, the show ended with season three in January of 1998. And then in 2001, because fans kept bugging and bugging and bugging Mainframe to make more more, despite having the best ending song ever, they made us half a season that didn't seem to get picked up for the rest and nobody knows what happened after Megabyte ruined everything. Okay, here is Discs with Matrix and Andrea, and I actually named my son, my youngest. His middle name is Matrix, specifically because of Enzo Matrix 
That's why I'm the fangirl, not a fangirl. Represent yo. Then we have Hexadecimal with her broken mask and Fong. Get these all perfect. And we have a last little booklet here, which matches the cover. And then we have one of the little vehicles on the back. And let's see what's in here. Reboot the complete series with a list of the voice cast. Love it, love it. A message from our sponsor, Reboot, best show ever. Without reading the rest of that, yes, yes it is. Then we have little character profiles quotes and other bits from season one. Let's hear it for the fans. Quotes and other bits for season two. Ooh, that is a really cool shirt design. I would buy that if they made it, but it says fan art, so I don't think they did. Still in season two quotes, and now we're getting into season three where the series gets super interesting, and I love that fan art by Mike Rieger, I think. And oh, look at the chibi reboot cast by Aaron Nagy. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. It's the cutest thing ever. And now we're into season four and a really cool poster of the cast towards the end of season two. And that's the end of the book. So I will put all these little bits back away, get them inserted back into my beautifully packaged box. And this has been the Reboot Definitive Collection for the entire series, minus of course the Guardian Code, which just recently came out. This box set is from 2011, so I think you can still find them used on Amazon. It's a really great set. It's a really great series. I totally encourage you to go check it out. Anyways, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time, family members! If you had fun watching today's video, don't forget to subscribe so that you can see more and let us know in the comments what other toy videos you might want to see in the future. Also, don't forget to check out our other channel, The Fan Girl, where we talk about all kinds of movies, TV shows, and even books and comics. But viewer discretion is advised. See you next time, family members!